Hello everybody, welcome to the second round in the winner's bracket of the planes. We've got Andy Davo with Frenzy Orcs, and it does actually have a Frenzy, uh, versus Inarian with Black Orcs. And in the booth with me is Dimmy G, the champ! Hello, Hello everybody. Hello sports fans. <laughs> what an exciting game this is. It is, isn't it? Really, it's four guard for Davo, a block and a frenzy. Oh, is this, is this Davo's pitch, is it? Because he played on the concrete pitch yesterday against Lizards. It was yesterday, was it, he played his Lizard game? Probably. Yeah, this must be Davo's pitch. Because mm. Anorian was playing on grass, right? I just think I think it's quite weird that he's picked this pitch. Maybe it's Hang to on. get extra equity versus people that don't realise he's got an extra set of tiles at the side. <laughs> oh man, yeah, those set of, that set of tiles is. <laughs> it's the it's the lizard one though, isn't it? Where like you the end you don't know where the end zone is. Like you don't know whether the end zone is the yeah. end zone or it's the row of triangles before the end zone. Yeah, yeah, it's That's terrible. <clears throat> I really like that Inarian's gone 14 players, so he can, you know, rather than Foul. an apple, yeah, so it gives him fouling options. He's got a sneaky git. He's uh, wasted two tackles, though, in, in this matchup. He has, yeah, complete waste yeah. of two skills. Really should have just gone blocks, I think, honestly. I, I know why he went with the tackles, but I think he should have just gone block. Well, it's probably anticipating Underworld, isn't it? Like, I, I guess a lot of people were just anticipating Underworld, right? Yeah, and Lizards as well, right? Like, the Lizards only dodging them a 3 plus is pretty nice, isn't it? But, um, mm. but for punching things, block is better, because you don't see many blodges. And defensively this. as well, yeah. Yeah, yeah. And not using rerolls, right? Yep. Oh, the lovely grab. Grab is pretty cool, isn't it? It is as a free skill. I don't think I'd like go out of my way to select it on play. The only the only player I can think that I'd want it on is a tree. Yeah, yeah, tree. It's pretty decent on a tree. Multiple reasons, right? The the one turn and the keeping next to people when when you root. Mm. So two reasons it's good on a tree. But I, I think it's good like for free. Yeah, I w I'm I'm with you. I wouldn't I wouldn't select it. Yeah, yeah, like, I love Black Orcs, I play with a ton, and, like, grab is great fun, and it's great, like, it's one of them skills that the more you have of it, the better it is, like, one grab on a team of 11 is, like, pretty irrelevant, but when you multiply it by 6, you can suddenly make a lot of plays with it. Yeah. Being able to, coming. yeah, being able to threaten the sidelines is pretty nice. Brawler. Oh, he gets away without the block there. <laughs> That's the thing. The thing that bugs me so much about Brawler is like, whenever you one in nine, you can't really use it. Like, yeah. I mean, you can use it, obviously, but like, it depends how critical it is for the turn. Yeah. Oh, Pretty sure. he's gone stupid. Yeah, I wouldn't have done that, Jim. I would and have, uh, well, would pick up. <laughs> and with the troll going stupid, he might. Well, I, I think Dave might come for his balls now. Uh. Well, yeah, he can knock down. Yeah, his whole right flank is wide open, isn't it? Very exposed. Very exposed. Hopefully he's left the cheeky surf on and Davo will ignore the massive gaping hole on the right <laughs> flank and he'll go for an outrageous surf, which <laughs> achieves nothing. <laughs> well, he's not going for he's not going for that uh, for the side you know the side breakthrough there. Yeah, I would. Interesting. Like, he's a fight. Davo plays very like punchy though, doesn't he? He's just going to try and maximise blocks and he's going to try and. Uh, out strength the uh, Black Hawks use the guard. Mm. If you were talking about him, you might say he's now but a greedy banger. Uh, I, I mean, I didn't say that specifically, <laughs> but. Uh... <laughs> oh, another stupid troll. Mm. Where's your troll superiority now, Elliot? <laughs> Where's your troll superiority? He's got a big line of orcs. Big Brit. The Ra the Rauga would have caz someone <laughs> on his own team, got up and then triple scold. <laughs> on his <Okay>. own team. <laughs> yeah, yeah. 
Oh my god. I can't believe I hate I hate uh what's it called? Rogers so much. Yeah, so this is yeah. <clears throat> I would have I would have been very tempted to like smash through that. I guess like he he had the opportunity to take the hit on that. Maybe like obviously he wasn't going to come through the side because he he moved all the guys beforehand. Yeah. Yeah, I think you but, know he, Getting guard on all these and obviously maybe blitzing him up as well. It was pretty, pretty decent, wasn't it? But just a yeah. I don't know. I feel like Blackhawks are so like weak around the ball. I think it pays off to like threaten their threaten their balls when you can. Yeah, that's the thing. They like when when they've got a big line of six Blackhawks and a troll in front of you. That's when they're at their strongest. But like getting the like. Offense on defense. Once you get past them, they're like they're very bad on the foot. Yeah, Brian, you're cutting out quite a lot here, Demi. But yeah, they're like, I mean, they are like lizards, Brilliant. right? Except lizards can just fuck off because the yeah. movement eight, <laughs> and uh, and goblins can't because the movement six. Is he gonna foul the troll? Uh, yes, he is. He is. Got sent off for a stun. Use the bribe. Use the bribe first to not get sent off. That increased his odds of not getting sent off, but uh, maybe he could have argued the call out because the turnover would have been okay. So, but that gave him maximum chances of not getting sent off by using the bribe first. Decent stun, isn't it? It's nice to see the uh, the fully customized teams. People have really gone in on the customization. Yeah, they've gone. Yeah. yeah, lots of spikes. Yeah, very spiky. They did chicken. Yeah, they did. They did. Can we uh, can we can we flash their actual kits for a second? Oh yeah, let's Just let's. See. Let's have a little flash of uh, what they've selected for themselves. Oh my god, Inarion! <laughs> what are Let's you going for? Maximum equity on the uh, eye pain? Oh my god, Inarion, what are you on? <laughs> you lunatic. Davo just going for the uh, the classic blue. Yeah. Nearly the same colour as, uh, as if it wasn't. So now gets a 2D. Mm. Then he rescues his troll from danger. And he does. KOs. Ap oh, oh. He hasn't got an apple. He, he doesn't have an apple. apple. Oh, Davo has got a bribe as well. Is that from a kickoff? Or yeah, is that... kickoff. Yeah. yeah. And no inducements were allowed. So. Oh, now he can foul that. Oh, I guess it, uh, yeah, it's not great foul this turn, is it? No. And these these Blackhawks are looking a bit sad right now, aren't they? Yes. <laughs> they're looking sad and isolated. They're looking a bit sad. They're thinking, why aren't we six Sauros with block right now? Why do we have tackle? Why do we have goblins? Why do we have a troll? What is this? It's up. I mean, Anarian's pretty damn good, though. I think he played the best out of everybody that I watched in the first round. I thought Inarian, really? Yeah, I thought Anarian played the best. But, um... but he's got a rubbish team. Like, he's got to play better, hasn't he? He gets to play better. Yeah. He gets to look better because he's he's forced to do <laughs> more creative things to, to win. <laughs> oh my god, Troll Blitz. Instant one. All instant one. Tough turn. Tough turn already. I wonder if he's going to grab that line in and foul it. 
Mm, might be all he can do. Fouling the Lionel seems terrible though, doesn't it? Yeah, it does. Uh... But maybe, no, oh well, guys. Oh, oh okay. I can say That'll maybe do. it was the point. Yeah, it was pretty good. Uh, maybe it was the point where fouling a Lino is the correct play. Like as terrible as it is, like maybe your your record is sinking that fast that maybe that's what you have to do. Yeah, I mean he's he's not sinking, Jim. He's parking on the bottom. It's fine. It's fine. <laughs> <laughs> Gentlemen, we are sinking. <laughs> I parked on the bottom. <laughs> I was going to say, yeah, this isn't a cage right now, it is. Rough. This is pretty rough for Inarian. The flaming heads are quite nice, aren't they, on these, these customizations? Yeah, some of them are all, like, some of them are all right. They're, uh, very mixed. A mixed bag. There's no sexy dwarf customizations, otherwise I would have bought them. <laughs> yeah, you don't want to encourage dwarfs, though, do you? No, absolutely not. Disgusterous. Yeah, this is looking rough. Yeah. Oh, really rough. Super rough, Jim. Oh, man. These AV 10 plus are not acting the way they should. No, Devo's carrying on from where he left off in his first round match where he made 10 cars versus Lizardmen. And Honestly, then... Jim, I'm looking at the pro teammate already. Yeah, and now he's knocked out three Blackhawks. That, that troll can throw the teammate. Turns. That troll can throw the teammate with uh, no GFI required. Yeah. He should base the troll. You can just blitz this blitzer, though, right? And then, and then go down and yeah. screen it. Oh, he's put the. F oh my he's goodness! He's removed four black orcs in three turns. Yeah. Tell you what, if Cyanide have pr pressed the big red button for Dave or to win this tournament, it's looking pretty good for him. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Holy moly! He's got to base that troll. He gets to turn the stall out of it if he makes the landing. Nah, I think he puts. I think you blitz this guy, you can just run through, right? You blitz, you blitz the frenzy dude, and then you can just run through. With your rapid movement six. Yeah, a couple of GFIs. Oh, oh got there's a sweeper. He's got a safety. Now that he's got the safety, now maybe you do go for the troll lob. <laughs> oh, he's gone for the yeah. blitz. That's the power. He's going to get surfed, though. This is a problem. Unless he breaks armor. He does not. Mm. We can make a bunch of GFIs and get like a cage here. How many rerolls? Three. Yeah. Well, this he's got to put someone next to the troll to wake it up. That's the thing, isn't it? And it's it, it might just stay there. It might just stay there. <laughs> it might, might it's sideline cage. Oh my goodness. Yeah, cage, oh my yeah. goodness. Well, it's better than rolling a million GFIs, isn't it? And he's in range with two GFIs. And he's gonna oh, I'm, getting, I'm, I'm getting flashbacks of uh, you remember uh, Igralius with the skink down the sideline oh, against yes. the chalk and yeah. chalice. Yeah, amazing. Um. How to win a game with two players, or how to lose a game against two players, <laughs> depending yeah. on your point of view. Do you, <laughs> do you put this guy in? Take a mighty blow hit. He does, and that lets him get the troll to here, which is pretty. He hasn't activated the troll. He's, that means he's not fouling, yeah. Okay. Oh, he went there. It's probably better, actually, yeah. Well, no, because he just can move the guard round now. He's got that guard big and that he slots in, and then he 2Ds in with the big and frees the guard. 
And then you can free the troll as well, or maybe even take the three dice with. Oh, it's not three dice, is it? It's a two dice of the troll. Yeah. But I think I think there is better than there. My instinct was to go here, but I think this is better. I'm sure Davo's figuring out how to surf that tackle bigger. <laughs> Let's put the guard in around the back. Yeah, yeah, that's pretty good, isn't it? That gives you two the both hits. Well, yeah, I mean, I just thought we'd put him in between the guard and the black. But I guess it keeps them both tagged, and it keeps it keeps um, an Arian from assisting the troll next turn when he picks him up. Yeah, yeah, that's pretty nice. Without following, yeah. Not surfing a goblin or a black hole. No, he's gonna blitz the front goblin surely and try and like wall off. You'd think so. Oh, interesting. He might forget, he might forget the jump play, gets the I'll, full power. I'll blitz with the other one to put the guard. No, oh, no, maybe this is better. Yeah, maybe this is better. Disregard, I wouldn't have, I would have done this. <laughs> Disregard. <laughs> Disregard this. Yeah, so that orc needs to come behind the guard. Yeah, Biggin can come back as well. I mean, th this one can go in front, right? You can go in front of the guard or behind the guard, either way. Well, if he goes in front, then Anarian just jumps over the goblin, right? That's minus two, but I guess he might be able to hit it. If he's going behind, then he should have done the blitz and the guard should be behind, right? Yeah. So it, it, is, a, it is a bit of a mistake now, I think. I, I, th I, I thought he was going to put the guard behind and the other guy in front. When he's I, got a one day this tackle, hasn't he? I think he? this is... Okay, ooh. Well, there you go, that's pretty nice, isn't it? Really nice. Yeah, you probably should... You've got a re-roll, so you, probably just, you should, probably should do this, but 1db, right? Yeah, because otherwise he can... He doesn't. You can't do a whole lot, but it's. You should probably just do it because it's good. You should probably do it because it's a good thing to do. Oh, diced. Kiss the fish. Mm. That gives uh, him another 1D. Yeah, and then he can chain the guard Gets out. Gets the right? pal? Yeah, and then he's chains this guard out. Mm. And then he can blitz through the other one. I would think chaining him out was he's chained him inside instead of outside, which is weird. Yeah, now he can only red dice. Yeah, it's not that's not what I would I would have hit, I would have pushed my goblin forward, I think. Oh he could up he'll surf the guard, that would be hilarious. <laughs> Three plus. Three plus. I mean this hill. is this is terrible, isn't it? I don't know what he's uh, well, he might. He might run. No, he can't even really run backwards. I guess he might run backwards. He might run backwards, stand the troll up. And, uh, oh yeah, break. the jump. The jump. He's going for the jump. Fails the jump. Yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Jumping when you've got stunty feels bad, though, right? You could have just chained him the other way and then three plus the through with. Dog. With the rerun, yeah. Mm, probably better. Well, I mean, if he chained him the other way, like. Didn't he have uh oh no. He wouldn't have no, yeah. Disregard. Disregard. Disregard this. Yeah, I think you should have changed him to chained him to the outside. Out like or to the inside and then blitzed him and then just dodged through, I think it's better than a jump. But I mean it's still unlucky, right? You're still seventy five percent to do the jump. I mean four KO'd Blackhawks is just yeah, oh my brutal. god! It's absolutely it's brutal, yeah. so Dyson. bad. Dyson, he's just got to hope he doesn't get the touch. Yeah, now. it's Davo's turn five, so he's literally removed the black orca turn, like, yeah. and he's yeah. Oh, this is real bad, real, real bad for Arian. You see, if he'd had lizard men, he would have gone. <laughs> he would have gone so many more squares forward. <laughs> It would have been, wouldn't have been as bad, would it? It would have still been terrible as Lizardman, but the fact you'd have all that yeah. movement wouldn't be as bad. It's getting to surf now, which isn't really great. I think it's all right, obviously, but it's not great, is it? But I mean, he's already so many players. Is up. he KO'd? Is he? Or is he fine? Yeah, it's fine. 
Oh, thick skull. Well, hey. Thick skull, baby. Best skill in the game. Woo! <laughs> oh! Fails the pickle. Fails the pickle. Oh, that's the best scout for him. Tell me there's a chance. No, Jim. So now you just dodge this goblin all the way through, uphill this guy, and then he gets up and scores. Three, four, five, six. Can't even can't score, reach. Jim. Can't even reach. Can't even score, Jim. If he was a skink, he could have scored. Hello, Skuro. <laughs> Come on. Come on. <laughs> Come on. I'm Dyson here. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry. Sorry, Skuro. I can't help myself. Absolute comedy mega. <laughs> and uh, and Arian allowed himself to be diced by a picking black orc, so didn't he? I mean, it's... yeah, yeah, he did. He did. That was a foolish mistake. He lost at the team selection phase. Lizards were right there. <laughs> Lizard men were right there. That's a horrible misclick, Jim. That's yeah. a horrible misclick. For some reason, he chose black orcs instead. Ah, so he's just going to go for the 1D blitz. Pick it up, hope for the best. Nope. Skull. Get the yep. pow! Scatter. Oh, scatter it, yeah, scatter it. Yeah, yeah. Get a catch. Oh! oh really? 3 plus, 3 plus, 3 plus. Gets it. Gets it, gets it, gets it! Oh, oh. my god! And now he's just got to survive. 500 dice and he might score. <laughs> but the frenzy's gone away. The frenzy for some reason has gone away from the ball, so that's nice. Yeah, oh, it's still nice. going to be yeah, three dice to block, right? Yeah. Yeah, you can just block him away and get this big one in. Uh, if he had yeah. two more to movement, he would have scored, yeah. Funny that. Funny how lizard men are a little bit better than black hole. Just a small matter of 22 movement. Oh, it's going to be amazing. So you can get the, you can get the guard in here, can't you? Which also counts as the assist. Then you can block him. And then one, two, three, four, five. So yeah, you could move this guy in somewhere as well. Make it a bit... Hex, hex goals. But the good thing for Inarin is this looks like he's stopped the counter score anyway. Which is massive because you have to throw teammate. Yeah. Yeah, it's really good. Really good to stop the counter score. Because uh, even if the second half falls to pieces, he gets none of his KOs back, then um, he might throw a teammate and get into overtime and somehow get something out of this game. Yeah. But he's staring down the barrel of, uh, of a loss. Yeah. Yeah, it would be boring. I get, I get what you're saying, Dwight. Right? It's good to see other people using teams that aren't as good. But... <laughs> But also, I feel like he should, you know, it should be. Oh, yes, yeah, so you can just blitz with a blitzer, can't he? Yeah, it doesn't mean you have, then doesn't have to do the 3D without block first. Yeah, but the thing is with blitzer with the blitzer is you want to pick it. Oh! oh. Yeah, you want to pick it up with a blitzer. You wanna, yeah, yeah so you want to pick it up. He did, he did do the blockless block first. Yeah. Blockless block. I don't know. This. Oh, he gets the power. We get the arm break. Interesting to put it there. No armor break. Gets the scatter. Gets the scatter again. <laughs> Into oh, the end zone. Oh, that's... this could be spicy. That's not where he wanted it. Frenzy in the scoring range, maybe. Not bad, is it? Just put him one over the one over the line. Run him around over to here. So good at blood ball. I even throw it. Actually, I know you don't throw it there. Cause uh... nah, I throw it next turn. Yeah. Or like hand up and throw. I wonder if he takes his one in nine hit with the. Uh... He does. Yeah. <laughs> he does skull out, but it's all right because he's still he's still trapped on the. Cro uh, crocs. Tro I guess <laughs> you do the. Dodge, I guess four you do plus, four plus dodge. it's the frenzy, yeah. yeah. Pick the tackle up first. Yeah. 
He's, I mean, an Orin done alright here, considering like it was horrendous. Yeah. Has he got a reroll? He's got no reroll. 50 percent Yeah. Oh, it's horrible. <laughs> well, screw it. wasn't just being that good. It was also anticipating that that is exactly the move he'd make, and just guessing the square and it being it being happening to be six squares across, which is pretty good considering I, I've got no idea of the squares on this board. <laughs> like I thought I was going to be in range, and I just oh, had gonna, no idea that I was going to end up not being in range. It was really. Bad he's going to blitz and base, and he. Yeah, I guess that's kind of safer, isn't it? Gonna GFI the troll? Nah. Well, oh, now, he has troll. To, now he has to dodge, yeah. I don't know, like, the, it's a 2 to move the troll, isn't it? It's a 2 plus to move the troll, and then getting the strength 4 on the way is pretty good. So, yeah, this is pretty decent. Oh, no 10 for an Aryan, just a 9. Four. Yeah, Noah's dive, it's awful. Yeah, so he's tagged both. That's pretty good, isn't it? That's pretty good. I think. Yeah. I think he's that's enough. I'm pretty happy now. Yeah, he stopped the score. Yeah. And uh, Andy can't risk the dodge with the ball carrier because uh, if he falls over and drops the ball, then an Orion might score. Right? Yeah. Do you know what would be amazing here? Would be if he clears all of this, lobs it at this guy, fails it, and then the. Uh, the black hole picks up the ball, hands it to the goblin, then the troll stands up, lobs the goblin, and goblin scores. So the goblin score is still on. <laughs> yeah, but I mean, I don't think he can throw it because of wildly inaccurate. Like, he's not going to throw it this turn, he'll throw it next turn. So I blitz that goblin on the guard on the ball carrier and then dodge the frenzy and I run the ball up and then we throw it next turn. Yeah. So there's not much to think about. Oh, wait, Dimmy, for fuck's sake. <laughs> I was trying to ham it up. <laughs> well, there's nothing to think about at all. <laughs> yeah, it's done. The turn's done. What is he doing? <laughs> Why is he wasting time? Oh, weird blitz direction. Why is it blitz from that direction? I don't know, Jeff. He's just crossed him two squares of movement. I think he's just giving up on the score. Nah, he dodged the frenzy, man, surely. No, I surely! Pretty, I think he's pretty much giving up on the score. Surely you can't be serious. I guess the frenzy is dodging back and over to the troll side, so to get away from the black orc, because obviously he can, run it, he can outrun the black orc if he dodges to the left, mm. whereas he can't on the right, so this is pretty good. Yep. I guess you re-roll the re -roll, re -roll the bail dodge as well, because it's... Yeah, you might as well. Yeah. So you're free-rolling at this point, only one turn for an Aryan, so... You are free-rolling, 3-2-2, three, two, two, to get a good scoring opportunity. That was the first one. Makes it. Does he need a GFI? Ball. Yeah, he's got a GFI twice. One, two, three, four. Yep, yeah. get some. I don't think one, two, three. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah you've okay. got to do it eventually. So you might yeah, have to do yeah, 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 yeah. Range. Troll could that throw the goblin at the ball. <laughs> Hang on, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. <clears throat> I don't know whether making the pass one better is, and leaving the GFIs for the score, is better than throwing the harder pass. But you could get tagged by the black hole, right? No, 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 he can still come to that, like, he can still GFI it, but he can oh, do it yeah. sideways rather yeah. than... Because I don't know, I can't work out the passing range from here. No, neither can I. I can't be bothered either, so... <laughs> just... Ooh. Oh! Big dead, Kaz. Dead, dead, Huge Kaz there. Yeah, he's going to dodge the goblin and uh, tag. You could just screen, right? Uh, yeah, maybe he's tag. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. The troll's in an annoying square, though. Isn't he, yeah. Uh... Yeah, he's trolling an Aryan. Well, hey! Hey, hey! Just high rolled off. Just just dice. Absolutely smashed. Those four KOs all happened in the first three turns as well. Yep. Standard. Yep, standard dicing. One in nine in the Oh, my God. 
So, did you say you Norin have 14 players? Yeah. Okay, so the Goblin Kaz doesn't mean Dinada, right? No, he's, if he's lucky, he gets, you know, well, not if he's lucky, if he's average lucky, he'll get two back and then have, have 11 still for the second half. But if he's lucky, he'll get away from this at nil nil and then have half a chance. Well, maybe he blitzes off the Goblin, does the GFI into the end zone, and then throws it from the halfway line. Oh, yeah, maybe. Oh, but it's, it's frenzy. frenzy, though. Oh, my God, Davo. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, of course it's frenzy. Amazing, he's just doing the foul first. Not Doesn't me. get Dinada. He's surely got to do the pass first. Surely. Well, I guess how bad is he at passing? He's, if he's PA4, he might as well do a long bow, might he? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, this one. Yeah, interesting. Oh no, so he's getting to do this. This is a 5 plus. Oh, he rolled a 1 for animosity. Animosity? <laughs> what, blitzers have animosity to blitzers? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, they just oh don't get the ball over. Once they get oh the ball, that's it, they don't score. Gods. <laughs> Classic. Love Pretty it. Funny. Nearly a, nearly a half time pitch clear. Regen! Oh my god, he killed him and he regen. Oh my god. Dead, dead, dead. <laughs> alive. Dead, 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 alive. Wow, huge KO rolls. Can he do a Galentio and get all of his KOs back? <laughs> oh, the old classic Galentio. Yep. <laughs> We've all been on the end of a classic Galentio in. We have, yeah. Oh, he gets two back. I mean, that's average, right? And he's still got 11. So this isn't too terrible. Oh, God, he got the two shit ones back, though. Ah! Uh. <laughs> he's missing blockers and not tacklers. Hey, surely you put the tacklers on the LOS, right? Yeah, I guess you have to. Oh, this is so rough. So rough for an Aryan. But he's got a chance. He's got... Oh, he's still got eleven players though, and he's he's got he's got the one turn from the trolls, so it's it's pretty terrible, yeah, obviously. But look, he's he's removed two of Davos, so Davos down at ten, right? And and Arian's a player up, and Arian is a player up. Now pity pity that six six of his players are goblins, but he's he's a player up. <laughs> I mean, I'm not bitter and twisted, of course, Doctor the Duck, but it was it was a bit of a Galentia, wasn't it? Four out of five KOs, but let me comedy mega. Christ. Pretty bleak, yeah. Pretty bleak for an Aryan, but you know it was pretty bleak before the tournament. Now, now that I've lost my game, it's looking great for an Aryan because he can get me in the in the next round and just beat me easily because he's got Blackhawks. <laughs> oh, would be great. Mm. I mean, it's just you know Blackhawks are just as hard for dwarves as, as it's are really. He's still yeah, it's got two tackle though, he's got two tackle. They could mm, be true. two guard, it would be a lot worse. True, true. Or two block. <sighs> or two multi block, or is that not allowed in this competition? Yeah, you could have multi block. It's now correctly funny. coded after 10 months. How does multi block work with grab? It just, it's fuck, man. You've got to do both. <laughs> like nobody knows, right? People can say nobody they know. knows. People nobody can, knows. People can say that they know, but they don't because it's so stupid. Because it's like it's they're resolved simultaneously, but there's obviously like no way you can resolve them simultaneously. So it's just stupid. 
Second tackle. Well, I can see why he did it, Captain Oates, because Blackhawks are so slow. Like if you, you know, if you're facing like a team that can do things like uh, elves or whatever, any variety of elves or you know underworld um, or uh, skinks, then they can just, you know, they're so they're so slow that you just need some tackle to give you give yourself a tiny bit extra chance. Is, is I guess what he thought. I still think he should have gone just block on them all, but I can understand why he did it. He could have also stacked, right? He could have not taken block on the uh, on the troll, and then he could have stacked. So that that might have been interesting, because he could have just taken guard on the troll then, and then like stacked a uh, something tackle mighty. <laughs> wow. Dave already loves breaking AV, doesn't he? <laughs> Pretty good at it, Jim. Roll elevens. You can be my wingman Way anytime. Than me. Oh my god, look at this. You can be mine. Amazing. Sea Bros, Raiders from Sea Bros. Hello Sea Bros, thank you very much for the raid. Glorious. Hello. Hello. <laughs> I'd ask how your game went, but might do the replay of it tonight. I don't know. I don't know, Jeff. I know. I don't know, Jeff. Tanks. I've got to be honest, I hope all of the lizards in the winner's bracket won, and all of the wizards in the loser's bracket lost. <laughs> That's what I'm hoping for. But... Yeah, and I'm hoping to win the lottery as well, Jim. Hey. I can't, I can't believe it was three out of four to win, wasn't it, at the start of all the time. Just didn't get it, even after everything. Ah, it's bad for me, it happens. It does. I said that from the start, even you know, as, as good as the matchup was, things can happen, can't they? And a pitch invasion that stuns your ball carrier is is one of the things that can happen. It did. Yeah. Oh. What's this? A suicidal goblin. Yeah. Just letting him train. Uh. I assume he's got a plan for that, not just to get three diced twice by frenzy. <laughs> because that sure looks like what's happening to him. Well, I mean, he could just block him without blocking him, couldn't he? A blockless block. A blockless block. Surely not. He does go for the blockless block. Gets the pow. Well, there you go. He got injured. Nice dodges. <laughs> Big payoff. Oh no! <laughs> oh man, the legend of Bezel. <laughs> that might have been my first ever content stealing of the uh, <laughs> was the Xbox. <laughs> Hello, Goliath. It's a great, great sound effect, isn't it? A great bit of content stealing from Jim. Hello, Goliath. It's the POW. <laughs> Another removal. Oh my god. I mean, that's just a goblin, right? That's, uh, yeah. yeah, but it's still nice. To be fair, I was I was removing at this rate as well, wasn't it, in my game, to be fair. To be fair. And it still wasn't enough. No, well, I'd lost it in the first half, really. Yeah. To be fair. It's 
So How many is he down? So there's four, five, six, seven, eight. So he's on eight. No, he's not. Yeah. He's on seven. <laughs> oh my! I can't believe these armor breaks. They're, they're like, insane, aren't they? They're not like yeah. These are like and they're they're AV ten plus man. It's, uh, <laughs> Just another... it's, this is some. Uh, this is some next level. I would. Uh, how many armor breaks did he get? Like I, I didn't watch his first game, but I saw the carnage at half time. Yeah, it was. It was ludicrous. The first game was ludicrous. The this first game the was an insanity dice. Yeah, this is yeah. just like this is just a comedy mega. But the first game was a complete insanity dice. This is. Uh, this is the form of champions, honestly. <laughs> This is like when Ungern won Chalice with uh, 28 armor breaks per game, right? <laughs> yeah, so, it is, yeah. You know? Oh, yeah, if he keeps rolling like this, he's not losing any games, is he? I think, I think he must have gone back, studied that Ungern run, <laughs> thought, right, what I need to do is 28 armor breaks every game, and, I, and I'll win five grand. Yep. And, uh, seems like an amazing strategy. Yep. We had to go for this after the uh, after the troll block, right? Because couldn't you have done this? Oh, maybe he had to do that first. Oh, he cast himself. Brilliant. No, no he, he cast the, the, the troll. He cast the. He cast the throw. throw. I mean, he's actually throw. improved Davo's team now, so he it's, has. Uh, yeah. Sadly, he's cast himself in the sense that he's cast Davo's worst ball carrier, and now he yeah. has to carry on someone competent. Yep. Yep, he's just given Dave a ball carrier block and plus movement. <laughs> yeah, exactly, yeah, yeah. <laughs> just levelled him up. <laughs> Diced again. Maybe uh, Dave will try and score on a Blackhawk for some development. <laughs> <laughs> yep, got to well. max them SPPs. Although he hasn't... Oh, he's got the Blitzer at the back there, he can pick yeah. up one, yeah. I uh, leveled up the rookie one. Another AV break, not a removal, but at least at least two stuns. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Even when he's not removing, he's still just stunning everything. It's unbelievable. <laughs> it's this concrete pitch, I'm telling you. It's, that's oh, what maybe, it is. Maybe, maybe. Have, have they got like a pitch effect where like, when you knock them over, they get plus one or something? <laughs> there is one of those. If I might change to this to this pitch and see if it's the pitch. Uh, maybe Dave will know something we don't know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they've got like, you know, because you used to have that, like, where you failed GFIs, it was plus one to the, the Astro Granite, wasn't it, or whatever it was? Yeah, yeah. Maybe they've just messed it up and done it to every time someone falls over. Yeah, maybe. I would only hurt myself, yeah. It's oh my cast. god, the second time the troll got cast, this time he's not coming back. That is the, there's the what throw teammate as well, so that, that is GG. Yeah, yeah it is. That is GG. Yeah, GG. Wow. Absolutely destroyed. Wow. Must be nice to be a dice lord. <laughs> I mean, I think Andy's actually got more armor breaks in this game than I have in the last year of Blood Bowl. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yep. He got more Kaz in his first game than my undead have in eight games. <laughs> yeah, that's just unbelievable, isn't it? <laughs> yep, pretty unbelievable. Doesn't break armor. <laughs> <laughs> Obviously, Devil's got to like you know take a few. This is nine removals. Yeah. This is nine removals. Plus he got what? He got two KOs back at half time, so that's eleven removals. And the troll regenerated, so that's twelve removals, right? Yeah. In one game. Yeah, not bad. Well, it's it's only turn twelve. It's a <laughs> removal a turn. Yeah. It's a, literally a removal a turn. It's all right. Plus yeah. multiple stuns as well. <laughs> yeah. right. Anything that wasn't a removal was a stun. <laughs> <laughs> Liquid blood. I mean, ball. if I think I might have to hit Andy up for another coaching session at this point. <laughs> Man, if you could coach dice like these, oof, you'd be unbeatable, wouldn't you? And a millionaire, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>
Yeah, you'd use it for something better than Blood Bowl, to be fair. Yeah. <laughs> <sighs> this isn't. Is this the nobility pitch? I thought the nobility pitch. Uh, I thought this was the OWA pitch, wasn't it? Or there's one with the running track, isn't that? The uh, I, I don't know. I don't why no. I don't this know why nobility. This looks pretty noble, doesn't it? These guys look pretty noble. They've got feathers on them. Uh, yeah, this looks pretty nobs. This looks pretty nobby. See, my knobs play on grass. It's. Uh, Oh wow, just a stun. Diced. Yeah, never lucky, eh? Yeah, never lucky. At least it's quick for an Aryan having no players left. Shit! <laughs> just, make, just make it quick. <laughs> I mean, he's... I thought that Blackhawk 4 plus 4 plus... Oh, they're only movement 4, aren't they? I yeah. keep thinking they're big ones and they're not. No, big ones are way better than them. What do you reckon if they gave Biggins movement 5 and gave, like, uh, I mean, Blackhawk's movement 5 and Biggins movement 4? Or just swapped them around? I guess then it wouldn't be a Blackhawk team, though, would it? And it would really be shit, uh, and it would really be shit Lizards if they were just movement 5. At least they've got something that isn't. Yeah. There's the both down look. Uh, <laughs> improved his ball carrier. <laughs> if that had been his throw, he would have knocked him over and maybe got nil nil. <laughs> Unbelievable. Well, that was a uh, interesting one. Yeah. You gonna stick around for another one or not, Dim? Who's who is it? Good question. Hopefully there's some knobs in it. I'll tell you. Oh. Who's Cairn oh. playing against next? I don't know, Jeff. When you said Cruz was at 9.15, did you mean in the morning or in the evening? Oh, I don't know, Tomorrow. Looking for ten tonight, aren't we? And Cruz. Kiander and Cruz. And Kiander. And then whoever the other knob coaches. At ten, we've got Azawain versus Ruzi. Oh, is Azawain knobs? I don't I know. I think he is. is. I think he is. Uh, well, that's on tonight at ten. Or oh, he qualified. Yeah, I think he is. I think Arzawain's Imperial Nobility. Who's Ruzi playing? Dark Elves. I don't know. I don't know any of them. I'll be honest with you. I'll be honest with you, Dimrath. I've really got no idea. <laughs> I've got no idea, Jim. <laughs> I don't know, Jim. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he got substituted. <laughs> He's been sent off. Was he? Look at hell. All of fucking... Uh, Kamara, yeah. Chris Kamara. Yeah, yeah. All of Inaring's team's been sent off. Jesus. I mean, sadly, this game was over on, like, turn four, right? Yeah, so. pretty much. Pretty much. Dave or not the place to go for interesting games of Blood Bowl. <laughs> Great if you want to see him smash the shit out of people in comedy megas. <laughs> I wonder what his removal rate... I, I've lost track of the last couple of turns, I've, uh, I won't lie. Um, I don't know if he's... Uh, that's 10 on there, plus the 2... 
plus one. He's on 13 removals, right? Yeah, 13 removals is alright, isn't it? It's not quite one per turn anymore. <laughs> no, I mean, it's been harder because there hasn't been people to hit each turn. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. At least Denarian got to prove how good Black Orcs are. Yeah. Yep. Hey, look, he could beat me in the next round. Very easily. I mean, that's the thing, isn't it? There's so many great coaches like floating about in this. Like, this is the this is a lot different from like the NAF tournament where there was a couple of guys in there that weren't the best, right? Yeah. Like, everyone in this is baseline competent, like you know. It's yeah. Like, and then and then you've got some extremely good players as well. Yeah. Yeah. Honestly, Hamas rule one: don't pick black ox. Really. <laughs> You know, I don't want to keep going on about it, but it is, isn't it? It's for money. Like this was for this was for five grand's worth of prize money. It doesn't I'm, matter. I'm really surprised he didn't take power with actually. I would have thought. Yeah, I thought he'd have taken something that could win. I mean, it's not over yet. It's not over yet. He could actually win something. Like it's. Um... Yeah, it's not over. It's not over. But like, he's got another round. He could he could get dwarves and get a free win, you know. So. Yeah, yeah, and he could just roll like this. <laughs> Anyone can, yeah. I mean, this is the good thing about the double elimination, right? Is if this happens to you, you're not out, right? Right, yeah. but you obviously can't afford for it to happen twice. But that that is the one thing because I was, like when I heard about the double elimination, I was a bit like what? But then like having seen games like this, like. Obviously, the first couple of turns of uh, Run Bad's game as well. Like, you just don't want to lose a competition worth so much money on a game like that. Whereas, at least with a double elimination, you're not completely out of it. Yeah. Oh, there's another cans. The finals is double of them, yeah, and the actual grand final is best of three. Another removal. The problem is trials aren't very good and their package wasn't very good either. So I guess he could have done what? gone dark elves. Yeah. Could have gone dark elves. <laughs> He's a trophy husband, he doesn't care about <laughs> Yeah, fair, but still I don't I don't know, even if you don't care about the money at all, at least at least choose a good thing. <laughs> I couldn't not choose a good thing. Yeah, correct, Elliot. I couldn't not choose a good team. I just couldn't. I couldn't. I could never choose. No matter how much I like Black Orcs, I could never choose yeah, you them. Big dwarfs, Jim. Jesus. Yeah, I could never choose them over something that I thought was better. And like, didn't even just even even drop the GG emote. Where's the where's the emotes in this game? Come on, I, guys! I've, I've got them blocked. <laughs> oh, what they don't? What? So if they're spamming emotes at each other, you can't see it. Yeah, correct. Oh man, that's like the best thing about Blood Bowl Three. <laughs> I enjoy those emotes so much. Like honestly, I mean, I can send them to people. It's just that I don't see them sending them to me. I was uh, I was spamming Mr. Page with despair. <laughs> <laughs> I uh, love it. Elliot's a great look. He doesn't care about the money. He just made a meme underworld team for fun. <laughs> Absolute scumbag. He is the epitome of scumbag. <laughs> no, I think they said tomorrow. I think Mr. Page said he's playing tomorrow against one bad. Yeah, they're playing right at the deadline. Like 11 o'clock yeah. UK time. So it's like, and the the game has to be done by midnight. So it's obviously not going to be done by midnight. So yeah, Rumbad's um, like apparently playing it immediately after work, yeah. which is another like drawback, isn't it? Like, cause I don't want to do anything immediately after work. No. Yeah, they have an hour to play. I don't understand how they've set the start. I don't know how you can set the deadline as to end by right. You can only set a deadline to start the game by. Because otherwise, people can like time grief to to win, right? Like, do you know what I mean? Like, let's say, 
Let's see. For argument's sake. I'm, I'm playing Elliot. We start at 11. I spend three minutes on all of my turns and I use all of my time bank and then we get to an hour and then it's over. So, you know, like, who, who then what happens with the results? So I feel like you, you can only have, like, 11 as the deadline to start the game. And then it, he killed it ends the troll. It ends. Amazing. It does sound like a tabletop. I fucking hate tabletop, honestly. Jesus Christ. Anyway. Wow. Yeah. You missed him kill the troll, Jim. I know, I wasn't interested. <laughs> I saw it, but it wasn't even worth commenting, was it? It was over. It was over. And uh, there you go. Congratulations to Andy Devo. Congratulations to Enarion, who might be beating me up with Blackhawks now in the next round, which will be sad for me. <laughs> and, uh, dead, dead, dead. There you go, yeah. Thank you for acknowledging the death. And, uh, and yeah, thank you very much, Dimmy. Being glorious having you in the booth. I mean, yeah, I'm just jealous. I, I, when you see that many removals, and it just makes me wonder, <laughs> how? <laughs> yeah, I too am very jealous. Yeah, his Davos two games, of of like, well, his first game has totaled my entire undead run so far. Like, honestly, he made as many cards in the first undead game as my entire undead run, and now with this game, with like 22, with you know, 12 removals in this game, 13 maybe, he's made. He's just, you know, he's he's beaten all of the chaos as well. Unbelievable, 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 unbelievable. Right there you go. Thanks for watching, everyone. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic.